Hi friends, how are you today? Today's video is about this wig that I'm wearing here. And I didn't think about it before I started. I probably shouldn't have worn a black shirt, but here we are. Now this is the Aesthetica Avalon and it used to be known as the Aspen. It's Avalon now. It's in the color 48. And I think this is such a pretty color. I don't see it talked about much on YouTube. I think I found maybe just a couple videos, but this is such a pretty, pretty color. I really like the contrast between the really dark four and that kind of medium brown eight color. I mean, how pretty is that? And in the sun, it's really, really pretty. I actually have a, I think on Instagram, I have a, a picture of me in the sun with, in, oh my gosh, it's so, so pretty. Just the, the way the sun hits it in, on that eight, so pretty. Let's get into it. So this is, like I said, it's Avalon. So it's kind of like a, um, maybe beachy waves, maybe. And it's a longer style. I wouldn't say it's mid-length. I would say it's a longer style. It does have a lace front, so I will let you see that. There may be some hairs coming out there. Right here, that's my hair. And it does have a mono side part. So just the mono part here. I have like a little room in here. You can see me kind of pushing down. But I do have a, a more petite circumference head. So that's probably why. Let me just tell you, I bought this wig on clearance and I'd never really thought about buying this one at all. Like it wasn't one that was really, I mean, I knew about Avalon because so many people have it, but it wasn't one that was like on my wish list. but I saw it and it was a really good deal. And I thought, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and get it. If I don't like it, I know I can sell it and make back what I paid for it. So I got it. Y'all, when I put this wig on, it was like the angels were singing. I mean, I know that sounds stupid, but I got like a feeling in my stomach. Like I'm like, this is awesome. I love this wig. I don't feel like it's too heavy. I think it's just beautiful. And what I did before I put it on just now, because I have worn it, I think like three times, I just went ahead and I kind of combed the ends just a little bit to get the tangles out. And then I sprayed it with water to kind of put the little curls, waves back in. The one thing I have noticed about the curls is that sometimes they'll start all curling together. Like, I'll kind of feel it and they'll all be like in one big curl. So I kind of just, every now and then, just go and separate them with my hands. Before I take it off, I'm going to show you all around. And by the way, I'll put the measurements somewhere up here so you know what the measurements are. And it's pretty much, you know, we have a little bit of a face framing layer right here, but for the most part, it's all one length, I think. And this is my right side. Hopefully the light with the dark doesn't like blow it out, but it might blow it out left side I haven't done a lot to Avalon like um, pull it back or anything I think maybe I pulled it back like this so it is you know just long enough to pull back with the clip back like that and I think that's really pretty to kind of have those just those waves like like that but I really really just like to have her down I think it's just really pretty like this let me go ahead and try to headband I've not tried a headband before it's just one that I had sitting in here just depending on what you like to do with the front um, you know you could do that and leave some of it uh, in the front there I think because of the 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 curls on it it is a lot to pull back like all um, all together. So there's quite a bit, I mean, you can see that's quite a bit of hair there, but you can still pull it back in a, in a, in a low pony. I mean, you could definitely do that. I'm not used to having so much hair. So for me, it would feel uh, really weird to have that much hair in a ponytail. You could definitely still do it. But I, I'm gonna say again, I just think when you have such pretty, pretty waves like these, like you should just leave them down or do like a, 
half up half down hairstyle I think that would be really pretty let's go ahead and look at the inside of the cap it's just a regular inside of the cap but we'll go ahead and look at it so you do have the lace front like I said you can kind of see that color a little better there let's get back see if you can see it yeah you can kind of see that it's such a pretty color inside you have that um, monofilament side part there with that lace front and then here you do have some permatees which you kind of need to or that it would just be flat in the curls so it would look probably wouldn't be a very good style I would say and then being Aesthetica they do the um, like hook closures so you have the hook closures there and there is an extended nape ear tabs look like that it's not like the soft ear tabs like the um, moleskin or whatever it's called but it's I don't know like a cotton or something but I haven't had any issues with it like itching or whatever So I don't have a lot to say about Avalon, only that I love this wig and I'm definitely not selling <laughs> this wig. Um, I love it and I'll be keeping it and I really even like the color. So I'm pretty open to trying some other Aesthetica styles in this 4.8 because I think it's a really pretty, um, I feel like it's a neutral color. I don't know, maybe that's why I like it because I feel, you know, it's more of a neutral, it's more of a neutral side of things maybe that's why I like it but yeah super pretty and she's not going anywhere except for on my head I've actually thought about getting Avalon and maybe one of the new colors that just came out the what is it coffee coffee house collection or something I don't remember but I'm like you know what I feel like if I got it and then didn't like it it would just ruin my ruin my love for it or something I don't know so maybe I'll just stick with this one thank you so much for watching I hope you will follow me on Instagram here's my Instagram handle and please like and subscribe and I hope you're having a great day I will talk to you soon bye